Okay, here are some of my props new this year, or most of them are new. Uh, Amelia the Alien Chicken, and Frank the Pirate. You need shoes still, you need to make those. And Rasputin the Zombie has a new hair color, I got the wig yesterday. And that is Mrs. Fitz's wig on Griselda's body. I need to get Griselda a wig head so that she has a head. Then Michael the Vampire. He has a cape now. There's his one foot. I need to get a shoe for him for the other one. He has a cape. And then Charlotte got a new hair color. She's not looking at the camera though, but yeah. My rabbit nibbling away on grass as I've been setting this up. She's so used to my bizarreness. <laughs> Here's more props, lighted props added to it. The cauldron has a strobe light inside and happy pumpkin and a mummy and pumpkin and fountain little skeleton that Amelia is holding Charlotte with the new hairdo no her lantern's not lit up there now her lantern's lit up she has no hand Then the Michael character, Michael Vampire. And his foot. Skull Dude. His eyes light up and they also move. He's motion censored. Not sound censored at all, apparently. It's raining all day tomorrow, so I can't put this up again, which is sad. I shall have to wait till it's another clear day. But yeah, the official start of Halloween season. Yay! Need shoes, still. <laughs> And it is now 8.42 p.m. And I'm going to take this stuff down for the night. For it to return on another sunny, non-rainy day. I just noticed that the camera is like face detection built in. So it like, it thinks that all these people... Props are real people. That's pretty funny. One time I thought a tire was a person. But yeah.
I think anything round sets it off. So these will now be automatically categorized in my computer as being people. <laughs> Yay! I love Halloween. I'm getting sidetracked. Can't really see it. That is my Michael prop standing over there. And it looks really creepy. It actually looks like a person because he's normal height. He's like, I don't know, six foot tall or something like that. So, really creepy. And right outside of my bedroom window, I think I might move that because if I wake up and see it out my window late at night or something, it's going to freak me out. He's really creepy. I mean, if he fell down, I'd probably scream. Like, if he moved or something? Man! There, now he's moved more like middle of the porch. He is really creepy. Oh, it's my rabbit. <laughs> She's hopping around in her cage. Man. He's heavy, too. Man. Pretty heavy, because he's only like... He's made of a uh, newspaper and a jacket belong to my cousin. Pants that belong to me, and I grew out of them. And a wig. Who I the wig I used for Griselda last year, but I think I'm going to use it for him because he looks pretty dang creepy that way. But yeah. And on that note.